The following program contains scenes with coarse language and mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. Tonight, get ready for the trip of a lifetime. It is not necessary to use your body as bait. Plenty dream vacations gone awry. What is this? From the slopes... Oh, that hurts. ...to the shore. Y'all, I had such a great time in Jamaica. Oh. Travelers so dumb, oh. they may not be able to make it home alive. What could possibly be scary about this? Featuring travel tips from our cast of celebrity sightseers. <laughs> It's True TV presents World's Dumbest Tourists. Look out! Bon voyage! <laughs> A sunny afternoon on the shores of Lake Minnetonka. Here we go. Check this out. Get out, here we go. My form, my form, my hips. Ah. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! skipped like a hundred yards. As if golf wasn't annoying enough. Now let's do it on water. Yeah, now watch this one, watch this. Ah! Smooth, going all the way, all the way to the island. Oh, oh, oh. Now, that golf shot takes a tremendous amount of practice. I thought the kid in the boat was going to get it. Oh, shoot! What? You surprised me. You turned it around. Next time, try the five iron. I don't think this ever happened uh, to Tiger Woods. I mean, I know he hit a lot of other people in the face with his balls. Ooh, Tiger. Wow. At a bar in Thailand, tourists can step into the ring and spar with professional kickboxers. I know I like nothing better when on vacation than being punched in the head and kicked in the stomach. How do you relax? After several beers, an Irishman named Marty tries his luck. All right, Marty's in the ring. Let's go, little fella. There you are. Sure, shake hands. Good luck to you. Here we go. All right, you're ready. All right. Yeah. All right, all right, oh, oh, not bad, not bad at all. You know, you don't really go into the ring with a professional boxer <laughs> unless you're Danny Bonaducci. I didn't realize you're serious, sir. Oh, I, oh, I'm doing that. Put a little Irish whiskey in your tight coffee, Matt. Work the body, work the body. Hook, hook. Put up a tanto. Come on, Mark. You can do it! Eric Cooper! No, take me down! Come here, little man! Stop running! Stop running! There you go! Oh, darn it. Marty's toughest opponent uh, does seem to be Marty. That's a flying kick! Oh, 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 Marty, that little kick where your hair flipped. It was cute. Here's one! Stop being so nice, Thai boxer guy. Punch him in the face. All right, here we go. And boom. Oh, 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 come on, hook him up. All right. Oh, oh, oh that hurts. Stop, stop moving. Oh, 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 let the tourist win. I got more here. Here we go. Second win. Stop hitting me, face. Too bad they don't have those kind of things here in the United States, because I definitely get my friends drunk and put them in the ring. <laughs> At Florida's Gatorland Park, visitors watch as a trainer coaxes a smile from Chester the Alligator. 
smile. I think your first mistake was naming the gator Chester, because I think he already thinks you're making fun of him. Chester. Chester, come on, buddy. Stand up for me. Smile. Smile, buddy. All right, here you Smile, buddy. Alligators don't smile. They open their mouth, they close their mouth. Those are the expressions. He's already, he's already had a two-person day. Oh, well, if the alligator's already eaten two people in a day, he can't be hungry for a third. I would prefer to be open a little wider, but... Do we want photo recording this? I don't care if you have a PhD in alligator. Why would you do that? Why? A visiting trainer decides to try the trick, too. Go down low, stay low. You're gonna go just above the bottom jaw, and then on the way out, on the way out. Oh! Total, total shock. Oh! Well, there goes his hand modeling career. How is this trick? You put food in the alligator's mouth, oh! and he ate it. Go down low, stay low. You're gonna go just above the bottom jaw. Go ahead, try it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I won't bite it. I won't bite it. Why would I bite your hand? Oh! <laughs> the trainer suffers a few puncture wounds and a broken middle finger. You know, this isn't all bad because the tourists get to have a little fun and they also get to restore their healthy fear of alligators. On the way out. Oh! Coming up, <laughs> meet your Jamaican tour guide. <laughs> I want his job. Get stoned and make up stories. Oh, wait a minute, I have his job. Plus, last call for this vacationer. I want my drink right now. Will someone please knock him out? <laughs> Thank you. And later, Boo's Cruise hijinks. <laughs> Finally, a woman who makes Tanya look classy. <laughs> when world's Dumbest Tourists continues. A group of British tourists is on a tour of Vietnam battle sites. When American enemy attack and Vietnamese become hiding there. When I'm traveling, I try to avoid any tour that starts with when the American enemy attacked. Yeah, but this is only for thin people. Yeah. No, that, I you hold it up. Well, well, yeah. point it yeah. out. And take it down. I think this is about as fun as it gets in Vietnam. This is their space mountain. Can we get in there? Yeah, you can. Yeah. Yeah. You're not able to just look at this and go, oh, that's an interesting piece of history. You have to get in there. We won't put the lid on. Go ahead and mess yourself, madam. You're already deep in the. You hold this one. No, I could put no. Good thing I didn't but we'll get this in. Oh, no. No, no, Drop, mom. Just drop. No, roll them off. Yeah. No, 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 I don't do it, don't Barely do it. Barely tell them my arm. <laughs> this is a woman who clearly has no sense of her own girth. Oh, Lord, I'm stuck. Help me, Jesus. I'm stuck in a tunnel. No, 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 Drop, Mom, just drop. No, 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 Wow, that's a great tour you're on. What's next? The deer hunter exhibit? Drop, Mom. Just drop. No, 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 I'd hate to see this lady on a tour of the French Revolution. Oh, this is a guillotine? Let me pop my neck into it. Meet Captain Crazy. 
a local legend in Jamaica, the captain gives tours of Bob Marley's birthplace and home. Good morning, John. What's going on? Hello. You know what I've been doing? I smoke this morning. <laughs> Basically, all he does is hang out and talk about weed. If that's what a tour guide is, I went to college with a lot of tour guides. In the mountain here, nine miles, you're like 3,000 feet high, up above sea level. So then, you don't even have to smoke. You already high. <laughs> Dude, really? This is the tour? <laughs> Oh, great. We've got ourselves the Jamaican Fran Drescher. I want his job. Get stoned and make up stories. Oh, wait a minute. I have his job. We don't drink and drive. We smoke and fly. Oh, my God. If I had to listen to this man for one more minute, I was going to just frickin' shoot the TV. <laughs> when that guy gets home, his wife is like, So, darling, how was work today? Did they buy the I'm so stoned and I've got the stupid laugh routine? Oh, yes, they did, darling. Shall we count a huge stack of money again? One lady said to me, Captain Crazy, I think you smoke on the job. <laughs> Off the coast of Thailand, vacationing divers explore the coral reef. One man befriends a moray eel he names Emma and feeds her sausages. Hey, Emma. Hey, Emma. There we go. Come here, Emma. Come on. Come on. Good girl, Emma. Good girl. Ooh, very hungry to be uh, Very hungry. Who gets that up close and personal with an eel? He's crazy. Hey, Emma. Hey, Emma. The eel bites off and swallows the diver's left thumb. If you're going to make a habit of feeding uh, scary eels things by hand, try to feed them things that don't look exactly like your fingers. I'm guessing that this guy will not be giving his vacation a thumbs up. The man hitches a ride to the emergency room, where doctors replace the lost digit with one of his toes. Like you're some type of freaking Mr. Potato Head, they're gonna switch your around? So now, instead of nine fingers and ten toes, he has nine toes, nine fingers, and a horrifying toe finger. Toe thumb! Toe thumb, run! Once his new digit is fully functional, the diver is back in the water with Emma. Good girl, Emma. Do you still have my thumb? Thank God he wasn't skinny dipping. <laughs> It's near closing time at a popular Bangkok bar. But one English tourist refuses to leave. Hey, I'm in Thailand. Where's my drink? And while you're at it, uh, when's the stripper gonna peel a hard-boiled egg with her cooter? Uh, if you were my order. No, no. The Thai people know karate and like ass kicking Asian, okay? Don't them. Would someone please knock him out? Thank you. The guy asks a question and gets an answer. Who wants it? Oh, that one guy wanted it, and then that guy wanted it. I guess that guy wanted a little piece, too. Don't you die here. Don't you die here. You go die on the streets where you belong. Don't 
You know you're in a sleazy bar when you can't die in here. It's the one rule that everybody follows. I want a drink. The laid out limey is carried out to the sidewalk to sleep it off. I want a drink. What the f are you drinking for? You should be getting like everybody else in Thailand. <laughs> Coming up. One, two, Hanging out on the beach. And hitting the slopes on a ski vacation. Go big or go home. Go big or go home. Bye ah. back. I guess you're gonna go with part B of that statement then, right? Plus, which one of our cast members shook her booty in Jamaica? She asked for it, and she got it, man. Oh. When world's dumbest tourists continues. After several cocktails, some vacationers in Mexico goof around. Devo, tricks, here we go. Oh! Oh, Ooh. You alright, dude? Oh, you okay, dude? This is why we have rehearsals. Practice makes perfect. Oh! I think there was actually bone crackage. I think I heard bone crackage. You saw when he went back, man. You saw his foot catch that guy right in the chin. He just went. Oh! Oh! Were these guys so freaking tanked they couldn't get together on a three count? Physics comes into it where you gotta count to three and understand the other person, and you need to really jump. He just went, what the He's he like, what? Wow. You hear this wow. Wow. And then you saw you go back. I was like, ooh. Excellent, Walter Cronkite. Now we completely understand. <laughs> there it is. I can feel up to the knuckle. Hey, Price, hey, you gotta uh, pay to get a good clip. <laughs> I've noticed a theme throughout this show. When people go on vacation, terrible things happen to their fingers. <laughs> so if you're a person who likes to do anything with your hands, for God's sake, don't leave your hometown. A group of friends hits the slopes on the first day of a three-month-long ski vacation. It's not really a ski vacation. It's called being unemployed. Gabe wears a helmet-mounted camera. Who's going? I'm not going to take a big jump right yet. I'm not looking to get hurt for a of the day. I'm Just so you know, I'm filming right now and getting all of you guys talking like old ladies. Talk, get fit. That's the motto. Okay, I mean, everybody knows that. When people give me the choice of going big or going home, I pretty much always go home. It's way better. I have video games there. Gabe asked for this. Well, actually, I am saying Gabe asked for this. What do you need, brother? What do you need? What do you I know you probably shattered your vertebrae, but I've got to check the camera. You know, so I can film you writhing in pain. Can we get some help? Can we get some help? Got yeah, injuries. Turns out Gabe goes so big, he suffers a broken back. Go big or go home. <laughs> yeah. I guess you're gonna go with part B of that statement then, right? Oh. 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 
At a beach dance party in Jamaica, a tourist shows off her best moves. <laughs> go, Tanya. Go, Tanya. Shake that booty, Tanya. Yeah. Go for your another green. Go for your. Oh, you all learn for that. Go for your. Oh, go for your. Teach her something. Yeah, yeah. Ready? Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, no. This must be um, one of these all-inclusive resorts I've heard so much about. Y'all, I had such a great time in Jamaica. The natives are so friendly. <laughs> Excuse me, Jamaicans. It's a white woman, not a trampoline. It's like, I got you. And then, oh, the reverse scissor kick leg flip. They're doing kung fu. That's just a move I saw on WWE. You don't need music for that. Come on. Okay, 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 okay. She asked for it, and she got it, man. I don't like when Sam gets in any part of me. And I'm sure it's in a lot of parts of her. I can't wait to see this chick on Maury Povich trying to figure out which of these guys is the father of her baby. Uh, oh, <laughs> yeah, <woo. laughs> Sydney, Australia. After a long night of drinking, a Ukrainian tourist finds a spot to sleep it off. On a cliff, 100 feet above the ocean. It's fine to get drunk and pass out somewhere weird. What's not fine is to get drunk and then to get physically ambitious and go mountain climbing. That was the most literal hangover I've ever seen. I want to know how in the hell he scaled down there and didn't kill himself. Let that be a lesson to your kids. No drinking and climbing. Fishermen spot the cliffhanger and alert the authorities. Uh, f***ing tourists. Hey, hey there. Hey, Skippy. Hey. Hey, f***ing head, wake up. Party's over. Come on, come on. <laughs> Who are you? How many fingers? I know this two-foot-wide ledge over certain death is cozy and all, but it's time to go. All right, there. Hang on. Hang on tight there. Okay. You don't feel so good. Yeah. Uh, so, so uh, grateful for you. What you have there? Oh, man, what a night I have. So, how much for a ride? I'll give you 70 rubles. I have such hangover yeah, in yes. the head. In there, in you go. Back on land, medics give the man a quick examination before sending him on his way. I think if you're going to drink, that's fine, but maybe not go walking on the cliff face after you've had a few beers. It happens every time. One too many drinks on the rocks leads to one too many drunks on the rocks. Yeah. Coming up. This is awesome! This is awesome! Oh! Oh! That house came out of nowhere. And a Mexican getaway that has these tourists running for their lives. Don't shoot! Please don't shoot! When World's Dumbest Tourists continues. Tourists interact with monkeys at a nature preserve in Costa Rica. He's in my shirt. <laughs> oh, you've got a monkey on your back. Leaf, that looks familiar, doesn't it? Yeah. possibly be scary about this if you look closely you can see that little girl's childhood being ruined I would have been screaming too if I had a monkey biting my leg just flick the and then you're okay in the monkey's defense that little girl was annoying someone had to do something 
to know your mom hates you. Get in the cage with the wild animals, honey. Go ahead. I'm so sorry, sweetie. There's nothing I can do for you. That monkey wants to eat your legs. He's going to. That was my vacation. Oh, it was great. Uh, we went swimming, went hiking. Uh, my daughter almost had her leg eaten by a monkey. It was just what we needed. A couple enjoys an afternoon fishing trip while vacationing in Spain. That's right, honey. You sit on the rock because it's so comfortable and watch me fish. How did I end up here? There we go. Oh. Hang on. Uh, damn it, snag. Uh, uh, come on, come on. Nice job casting your line there. What were you trying to catch? Squirrel? Damn it. Come on. Check it out. Come on, come on. He's fighting it. Oh, I got a big one. Yeah, you got a maple. Come on, come on. Damn it. Come on, sell us. Cut the line. Cut it. Stop. <sighs> oh, oh, no. Use your body as bait. No, no, no! I think the fish in this area can pretty much take her easy. They're gonna be safe. Who is cold? Fisherman is reeled in downstream. You know, the worst part is that tree totally got away. Hey, uh, we'll get him next time. No, you won't. Probably won't. Vacationers in British Columbia decide to make their kayaking trip a little more adventurous. Extreme! <laughs> Sweet! I would think this was a really dumb idea if it didn't look so totally fun. <laughs> Sweet! That was awesome! All right, now we gotta step it up, guys. If you'll just turn your head a little bit, you'll see water, which is where kayaks belong. <laughs> At least you know you're not gonna get attacked by a shark or crocodile. <laughs> yeah! Rock and roll! Oh! Oh! oh. Are you okay? What part of boat and dirt don't go together, don't you understand? My turn, let's do it! You ready? Yeah. That house came out of nowhere. This is so cool. Oh, oh! It seemed safe. I don't understand what went wrong. Yeah. Oh yeah. This is great. This is great. This is great. Oh, oh! The overland kayaker is rushed to the ER with a bump on his head. He makes a full recovery. This is like that game: rock beats paper, cabin beats kayak, and brains. Oh! Oh! Hey, hey, yourself, hey, hey, hey. A tense encounter near the U.S. Mexican border. <laughs> but this isn't an illegal crossing. <laughs> it's a Mexican theme park where tourists get to experience what it's like to attempt to sneak into America. Oh, a tourist attraction where you get to simulate illegally entering the U.S. Was Hotel Rwanda totally booked? Oh, my God, honey. This is so much fun and so exciting. Oh, my God, they're after us. Okay, let's go. Hey, hey, yourself, hey. Oh, 
this is me being chased. This is, no, they're blanks. Yeah, no, that's, that was a flesh wound. Very realistic, you had to pay extra for that. Yeah, no, Obama, uh, if you see our fake border patrol staff, run like hell, because they will beat you. Is this a theme park or a training camp? So, um, I thought we would go to America, but we're gonna do like a dress rehearsal, you know, just to see how we are and the circumstances. Where are you from, man? Thunderous! Most visitors to the park eventually get busted by the fake Border Patrol officers. I know you paid money for this, but I'm going to kick your ass. I'll tell you what I call this theme park, uh, not fun. I don't want to go. Not interested. I'll stick with Six Flags. You have fun with whatever the f that is. Coming up, when in Rome... Act like a douche. And how to avoid heavy luggage fees. <laughs> Security's gonna be real fun now. Please remove your shoes and 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 the shoes you're wearing. When World's Dumbest Tourists continues. While on a cruise, some tourists decide to film a fellow passenger. It's been personal. Okay, look into the camera. I want to have sex with Danilla. He is our hostess from karaoke, and he's hot. That's my classy girl. Mm-hmm. I love when she drinks. She drinks a lot. I don't know. Did she have too many drinks? Or did she have just enough drinks? I think it was just enough for us. Your name, Celeste. Whatever you wanted to be. Yes. <laughs> I am Celeste. And I will molest Danilla. Danilla. How low have you sunk when you're hooking up with people whose names sound like ice cream flavors? I got one thing to say to Danilla. Run for your life. I am Celeste and molest <laughs> Is that licking thing code for something? Am I missing that? What's that? I just want to have sex with Danilla. <laughs> Enough about this legend. Let's see the fake. Celeste, where's Celeste? Yo! Come on, doll. It's Danilla. That's the ass. Show us some ass. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Sister, you need some sun on that ass. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Is that a bruise? <laughs> did you did you <laughs> that a bruise? That butt has done some living. Woo! <laughs> All right, signing off. Three, two. <laughs> Finally. A woman who makes Tanya look classy. I feel like hot sauce is coming out my nose. Oh, damn, fart. That came out of my ass. Boost my titties up even bigger than they are. <laughs> At an airport in Malaysia, an English traveler discovers his suitcase is over the weight limit. Rather than pay for the excess baggage, the man decides to remove some items and wear them onto the plane. Are you happy now? Any leeway? Does have to be 22? Oh, you're such a nice guy. You know, it's just nice to see someone being a in a foreign country who's not American. Yeah, you're good at your job. I, I love KLM. <laughs> I'll, I'll be telling everyone to blow KLM. Ladies and gentlemen, British sarcasm. How much that we? Twenty-four. Is that cool? Twenty-four cool? Really? You want me to take more out? Oh, How many pairs of shoes do you need for this trip, princess? Hey, that's the best. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
tourist attempts to register a complaint at a hotel in Cuba. I want to talk to you about my room. I want to... It's sad. America's embargo on Cuba means that they have to import all their drunken tourists from Canada. I know what you have to say. I just ordered a king size bed. And you didn't give me a king size bed. I think you give the guy one more beer. That's all he needs. Just one more. We should just sell this clip to the Nature Channel. It's like the rarely seen impolite Canadian. He's gonna make a buffoon of himself regardless, but socks and shoes would have bumped him into that extra 5% of dignity. Don't comfort the guy, keep the crap out of him. Give me some entertainment. You're in a foreign island paradise, and you're videotaping the drunk guy in your lobby. Which one is the dumb tourist here? Well, I cable down. With the help of hotel security, the guest is moved to a new room. Ah, the salt. Uh oh. Take your average hangover, then add the pain of hitting your face on the floor like 11 times, and then add the fact that you're in a Cuban prison and you don't have shoes on. That's the next day for this guy. The Trevi Fountain is one of the most popular attractions in Rome. Oh, look, it's the Roman fountain. Big deal. Woo. How does that saying go? When in Rome, act like a douche? Hey, look at these. Roman coins. Here, take them. Who cares? But I've thrown pennies in there. He's stealing my dreams. Uh, water? We have water in Russia, too. <sighs> you don't think, by any chance, this could be Danila? Do you? I just have a feeling. Hey, come on. Get out of the fountain, huh? Get out of the fountain. What's going on here? Look, police ain't even chasing them because they don't want to get their uniforms wet. Well, he will either drown or we will arrest him. It's the Italian way. <laughs> okay. Now I show you how we do things in my country. Like real men, huh? There we go. Mwah. Mwah. Thank you! I love that he covers his balls before he jumps. Ah! Woo! Safety first. Okay, officer. Now, what were you saying about that? Oh! Ah! Damn it! He can successfully dive into shallow water, no problem. Walking on land, different story. Okay, what were you saying? Oh! 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 Uh, Police arrest the diver and throw him in jail to dry out. Okay, what else do you have to do in this country, huh? What else? Don't. Way to make the most of your time in Rome. I hear their prisons are lovely. Oh, mwah! Ha! go! Woo! You've circled the globe with 19 dumb tourists. But there's one brave soul who qualifies as the world's dumbest. Find out who it is next. Oh.
two friends vacationing in South Carolina discover a remote creek with an old rope swing. One, two, three. One at a time on the rickety rope swing. Let's make that a rule. Two, three. Oh. Oh. Claudia! Claudia! Claudia, Claudia, wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Not exactly Captain Sullenberger, was he? Claudia, Claudia! Oh, Claudia! Oh, my God! Oh, God, wake up, Claudia! Wake up! Wake up! Play it cool, man. The video camera's still rolling. Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! What do I do? It's, your head's open. You have a lot of blood coming your head. Oh, my God. This guy really needs to work on how he breaks bad news to people. It's, your head's open. Oh. When you tell someone that their head is open and their answer is cool, uh, that's when it's time to panic. Someone help! Calm down, Morgan. Oh, no! This not sticking, oh my god! Calm down, Morgan. Morgan, calm down! Oh, no. You're out of control, boy! I'm starting to think that Morgan's the one that suffered the head drum. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Calm down, Morgan. Oh my freaking god. Oh my god. You gotta calm down. Morgan, oh I'm gonna ask you to shut up and calm down and just let me die. Leave me to die, Morgan. You may have to run for help. I really don't want you to do this. I can't leave. I can't leave you here. Go, Morgan. You've got to go fast. Run, Morgan! Run, Morgan. Run! Stay calm! Claudia is taken to a nearby hospital where doctors put 24 staples in her head. It seems like a dream, and it just kind of seems fun now. Apparently, after her recovery, she had no memory of the incident. <laughs> or that shrieking pussy who she went swimming with. Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! What do I do? It's, your head's open. Do you mind going to uh, tourists? Nope. Oh, oh no! Don't don't put that in the show. This is like a girl's gone with God. You can eat. Go, go ahead. I'm gonna take a break. No problem. I like to work with the people. Oh God. Okay. Sorry. Oh man, dude, I don't feel good at all. And he's still drunk. <laughs> Attractive. Oh no. <laughs> My hands already smell like sausage. <laughs> yeah, that's great. Oh, that'll definitely get in. The following.